Hey guys, it's Abby, and in today's video, I'm gonna go ahead and be going to IKEA today. I'm gonna go ahead and vlog today and tomorrow, so today's vlog will be like a two in one sort of vlog. I'm not sure I'm gonna have time to make an opening for tomorrow, but I will be getting my hair done. As you guys can see, my hair is quite light compared to how I had it before. My hair was jet black. So I would actually dye my hair jet black with like the box hair dye. My hair is actually a naturally dark brown, but it's still quite dark, but not as dark as maybe jet black. Pretty much what I would go for I think I've had my hair really dark like jet black for a couple years now I think the last time I did my hair more like a light brown color was probably in high school um, middle school and high school is when I went light, but I never got it professionally done So it didn't really look that great here I've had black hair for far too long and I want to get like a nice change I love the hair color and I can't wait for it to get a little bit lighter. Anywho, I'm so excited for today um, I'll show you guys also my full look right now You guys can kind of get a general idea. This is more like a princessy prepped look You guys will be able to get a better idea of what I'm wearing once we go to Ikea So anywho, I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go because I will be here forever. Yeah, ikimashou! These are so cute. It's got these pink hearts. It's meant for kids, but it's still really cute. This is my outfit for today. I'm wearing this really cute Eda bag. It's black, as well as like a very cute. This reminds me of like a sailor uniform, like they have that kind of top, except it's very girly. And then I'm wearing a black schoolgirl skirt or a pleated skirt, I think it's called, um, or a line. I'm not sure. And then I'm wearing these cute little. I think they look more princessy. This is more for like a princessy preppy look. I have other ones, but I felt like these would look better. And then I also, of course, wore some socks, as you guys know, with um, regards to like Japanese fashion um, socks and these accessories. So that's something you can go for. And I also wear a cute little bow on my hair. So today's look is like a cream with a mix of black. And this is look. Let's go ahead and do a little bit more window shopping. Guys, look at this room. It looks so pretty. And the really pretty white flowers, these are cream flowers, matches my shirt today. Ooh, I think this is a closet. Ooh, there's actual clothes in here. Really nice. The bathroom is so pretty actually. I like this one better than the other one. I like like the cream tone colors. I my room is like all white. Like I prefer more bright colors. I feel like the light goes into the house really nicely. So we are doing some cooking. We just we just moved in our little house in Japan. Ratatouille. I wonder if you can open the fridge. Ooh, you can open the fridge. Oh my god, it's cold. Oh my god, I'm surprised it actually worked. The freezer be frozen. Oh yeah, it feels cold in here. I'm, I'm, I wonder why it actually works. This is a really cute little area. Once again, I'm gravitated to the more cream colors. I just feel like the light really shines. Like it just gets a lot brighter. Like it makes the room look a lot brighter. I think it's really nice. Oh, this is really cute. White bed sheets and black polka dots. Look how pretty this flower is. It's pink. I'm trying to literally find anything that's pink. I will literally film it. This is nice. We got our bed here. We got our mirror. Here we want. And a cool bathroom. Is this open? Yes, it does. Oh. We are at the food aisle here in Nike. 
Let's see what they have. They have some meatballs here, some salmon, some crepes, crumble cake. We got some heart waffles. Super cute Swedish pancakes frozen. Looks like crepes. That looks actually pretty good. Apple crumble cake. We got some almond cake, I think. I'm not sure what a couple what a couple of these stuff are. Like I, I don't know what this is. Cream smoke row. I don't really know what that is. Let's see what my sisters found. Oh, coffee. Very famous heart cookies that I always see all the time and I've never purchased, but they look so cute. We got some strawberry gummies. Blueberry flavor. Some more sermon. These actually look pretty good. I kind of want to get some. They have more sweets here. Oh, these are cookies. What are these? Oatmeal cookies with chocolate. I'm not a big fan of oatmeal cookies, to be honest. I mean, I don't like the raisins that oatmeal cookies tend to have, but these seem to just be chocolate and like this oatmeal. I don't see any no signs of um, raisins. Let me know if you guys like raisins. Are you guys team raisins or are you guys against raisins? I do not like raisins. They have more cookies here. So it's been a couple days since I last dyed my hair. I went with my hairstylist and she was able to get my hair a lot better than it was before. So I did go through a small process to get my hair light because as I explained to you guys earlier, my hair was dyed black. At first, you guys probably see so many videos with me and my hair is jet black because I would constantly dye my hair with a box hair dye. Um, I would dye it black. Um, so when I went with my hairstylist and I asked her if my hair would be able to get light um, She said it would be pretty difficult the first time you guys probably saw my hair was sort of like a ginger color at the beginning of this video You guys saw that um, and now I ended up going back with her um, And we got it a little bit lighter and she ended up using a ash toner to my hair now as you guys can see the hair still looks a little bit more um, Ginger has a little bit more of like a slight reddish tones to it um, but it is totally to be expected because my hair was dyed black. I still love my hair. I think it's a very beautiful color. It honestly reminds me of Azuna from SAO. Her hair is so cute. So I'm definitely very happy with my hair color. If you guys have been planning or just debating whether you guys should go lighter in regards to your hair color, then definitely do it. This is a sign for you guys to dye your hair and get it lighter. Give yourself a new change. I really felt like I needed a change. I've had dark hair for the longest time and I really wanted to kind of change things up a little bit. As you guys know, I was really struggling with my mental health and now I'm in a really, really great place right now. I feel so happy, very motivated. And I definitely wanted to have a change. I thought, you know what, uh, for the longest time I've had dark hair and one of my darkest times in my life, um, I've had, you know, I had dark hair and so I really wanted to have a new change. I feel like, you know, a new Abby. Um, I feel so much more energized, so much more, um, so much happier and I definitely wanted to have a new change and uh, for me, I'm um, doing a new hairstyle, doing a new hair color definitely gives me a whole new vibe, gives me a nice boost of confidence. This was definitely a big change for me as I was very attached to my dark hair and I really have learned throughout this journey is that attaching to things isn't always good we need to surrender to our situation surrender to different things and I thought you know what I'm gonna go ahead and face my fear and I'm gonna do something different and I'm gonna get out of my comfort zone and dye my hair lighter so this is the way my hair turned out it is so cute and it honestly was the best decision I ever made so yeah if you guys are planning on dyeing your hair light if you guys have been debating for years or have been thinking about that for a couple months now then go ahead and do it I was like I think I want to do this and I went for it guys and I'm so happy with that decision so go ahead and do it this is your sign to go ahead and do that hope you guys enjoyed this video this is the end of the video do you you like this video if you enjoyed it subscribe to my channel to become part of the kawaii family i am so so happy to see that this family is growing thank you guys so so much for your beautiful and kind comments i read all of your guys's comments and i just love to see how kind you guys are as well as to see how sweet this community is this kawaii community that 
um, we are all kind of a part of. I'm so happy to say this family is growing. So thank you guys so, so much for becoming part of the Kawaii family. It means so much to me that you guys check out my videos. I'm really very, very thankful. Whenever I write to you guys saying that I'm so thankful that you guys took the time to watch my videos, it really, I really mean it. It means so much to me. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me at the official underscore Abby on Instagram. I'll be leaving a link to all my social media accounts in the description box below in case you guys are interested in checking them out. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Mitte kurete. Arigatou gozaimasu. Bye bye.